Are you ready to learn the two-part pause drill? Well, I'm gonna show you. I'm Cassie Neiman, I'm a Yukon Row 2 Master Rowing Instructor, and today I got a new drill for you. So the two-part pause drill is just like the regular pause drill, except we're gonna pause twice. The reason for that is to focus on getting the arms away out of the finish, followed by a body swing, and then we continue up the stroke. So what we do is we'll start up at the catch position, nice, good, strong position where our shoulders are down, chin is up, neck is long, our arms are long and straight, our feet are close to flat, shins are close to vertical. If that gets you back here, that's fine. No reason to make that catch uncomfortable to just start the stroke. So we're gonna drive through to the finish and get the arms away. That's our first pause. Our second pause is going to be getting the body over. Then we'll row again up to the front and we'll come back through into that finish. So we are pausing with the arms away to reinforce those hands always moving out of the finish, followed by that swing. Oh, everyone forgets that swing. We don't want to. Then we come up to the catch, back through into our finish. We don't wanna pause at the finish. We wanna get those hands away into the body swing, and then we go again. So this is a way to really break down that stroke of remembering that our hands are always moving. The body swings, we gotta hinge from those hips, keep the chin up, get nice and tall so that we can get into a good catch position. All the way through, arms away, row, row. So we're pausing twice, arms, body, row back up, arms, body, row. So by breaking this down even a little further, we can really, really reiterate, no pausing at the finish, get that hip swing, 30% of our stroke, we don't wanna miss out on it, and get everything set up before the catch. So. Try this drill out, try breaking it down, see what it does for you.